I'm sure you remember this level because we spent most of the last episode on it. Now you'd be glad to know, at some point in the last week, I changed the batteries in the Wii Remote because a bad workman blames his tools. Although, to be honest, for a lot of the last episode I was blaming Yoshi. But if you think about it, Yoshi is kind of a tool, so... Right, just need to get back into the rhythm. Oh, well. That's not a great start on the whole rhythm thing, is it? Okay. Now, I was a bit of a sneaky sausage, and I did go and collect a few extra lives before I started, so that we wouldn't get a game over. Because, to be honest, I don't really like this level that much, and if I can start from checkpoints as much as possible, I will do that. So, yeah. I started with eight lives instead of five, because I cheat, apparently. The jump between each one in turn seems to work, as long as you remember not to spin. And also if you remember that flutter jumps suck! Yeah, S Yoshi, seriously. This, you can see why Yoshi is a tool, right? Because he just fails at everything. I don't know why they keep picking him up, he's not actually that useful in this level. His flutter jumps don't really help. Then again, neither does spinning, to be honest. Oh! Sometimes you clip through them when you fall off, and sometimes you don't. And it's not great to try and rely on that. I know in the last episode I was getting super, super lucky and getting myself out of tight spots with spins and mini wall jumps, but you can't rely on that working. Okay. Let's pick this Yoshi up, because... I don't know why, really. Oh my god. Why is it that as soon as I get on Yoshi, everything goes five times worse? I am ignoring all the Yoshis from now on. Unless there's a level where you require a Yoshi. In which case, I'm kind of screwed. See? Perfectly fine without a Yoshi. Well, I mean, that's not the bit where I died. Here we go. Right. Okay, well, I was a bit off with the timing there. I thought it was about to change back. And I was slightly too early for it, so... My own prof. My own prof. Also my own fault. But it was my own prof, too. Uh-oh, didn't mean to spin. Okay, see, sometimes I get super lucky and recover. Other times, I just fall to my death. Like that. The annoying thing about this checkpoint is there's no easy extra life. There is that one there that I just failed to get. Spinning is not helpful on this level, but I'm so used to doing it in this game that I just automatically do it when I'm not about to make a jump. So I need to try and stop myself from doing it, if possible. Anyway, there's no easy... I'm just going to take a second, a second of quiet, to contemplate how stupid, how stupid I just was. So, clearly it wasn't the batteries in the Wii Remote. I'm just going to say that. Although, to be honest, having full batteries is probably helping the whole control situation. So, it was worth doing, probably. Here we go. Here we go. Let's be super safe about it. That was not super safe. In fact, that was almost super death. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh dear, we've made more progress than before. That means we're about to die, probably. Okay, that was a mistake. Here we go. Let's actually do it straight this time. I was a bit wonky that time. I didn't, didn't like my odds. Here we go. I have a funny, I have a funny feeling in my tummy right now that I'm about to finish this level. Please tell me it turns off the flipping when you get the star out, because if this platform is about to fall out from under me when I've just revealed the star, someone's going to get stabbed. Okay, it's fine. Thank you, Mr. Level, for being a complete butthole. 
Luckily, it's a butthole we never have to look at again. Don't spend too long looking at buttholes. That's my life advice for you. 82 stars. And that lovely, lovely galaxy is complete, which means we we'll never have to see it again. Look at all these prankster comets. Gravity gauntlet. Let me guess, Daredevil run? Time limit, speed run, purple coins. Don't know what you want, don't really care. Seriously, his name is Johnny Annoying for a reason. Right, what have we got here? Haunty Halls Galaxy. Let's go here. It's the closest one, why not? Here we go. Whoop, whoop. I'm going to stop guessing what they are. Cosmic Clones. Okay. See, I wouldn't have guessed that. I was going to guess purple coins because I always guess purple coins. Okay, so I'd forgotten what this level was, and now that I've remembered, I'm thinking, well, for a start, I don't think Cosmic Clones are really going to make too much of a big deal. Why is there a Luigi here? Also, I like how I called it a Luigi instead of just it's Luigi. Okay, the only annoying thing about the clones so far is that I can't really see. Other than that, they're not really making too much of a big deal out of it. Like, then, I don't feel like they're a threat to me walking into them. It's just more the fact that I can't see through them. Uh-oh. Okay, so... I don't know how I'm still alive, but I am. Okay, here we go. Nice safety of a real platform. Oh dear, nearly fell off. Oh dear, nearly fell off again. What was wrong with that? Okay, one, two... And there go the Cosmic Clones. That was what I like to call a success. Why can't all levels go that quickly? Because you'd finish the game in half an hour and you'd be really annoyed that you didn't get very much value for your money. Oh yeah, that's probably why. 83 stars. There you go, that level took 57 seconds. Hopefully that means we're going to get a lot of levels done in this episode. What's up next? Now I'm aware this one's still here, but I don't really want to do it right now. So let's go see what else there is. Okay, most of the ones in here are complete. World 2, what have we got here? Most of the ones here are complete. There's just a comment medal there. World 4 has this one to do. Let's go there. Because I actually quite enjoyed the speed run of the boss level in the other episode. Or the other episodes, because it took more than one to do it. So let's go see what's in store at the Gravity Gauntlet. Whoop! Whoop! Speed run! I have a feeling all the boss fight pranks to comments are going to be speed runs. Either speed runs or Daredevil runs. Okay. We know where the star is, and it's another one of the ones where you get a very little amount of time and you have to keep topping it up. But that's fine. Here we go, let's get started. We're going to ignore as many enemies and fireballs as possible. Or we're going to get hit in the butt with a fireball. Oh well, right, Magic Cooper is not really my concern right now. Unless he comes back to fight me. Okay, didn't spot that there was going to be a fireball there. That was my own fault. You're in the way, so that will do that. Oh, it would be nice if there was time in those boxes rather than star bits. Hang on. There we go. Didn't mean to long jump. Luckily, you can stop yourself. Okay, that was my butt. That was very lucky. Yeah, okay, I wasn't paying enough attention. Note to self, pay attention. Here we go. Okay, I've gone really slow. This is not feeling like a successful attempt, just because I've taken so long to even get to the first clock. I don't know. I don't know why I killed him that time. I just felt like it. Didn't really take any much shine. Okay, so I landed in some fire, but it's fine. That's what coins are for, right? 
Okay, don't stop for star bits, they're pointless. Someone should build some stairs that Mario is actually tall enough to climb properly. Okay, here we go. I feel like I've spent too much time just standing around doing nothing. Thank you, just needed that life, because otherwise I'm about to die. Okay, I'm not really sure. Do the controls remap? No, they don't. That's why I'm confused. Didn't want to do a backflip. Oh, I'm dead. I am dead. I am so dead right now. Yeah, come on. No. Okay. I'm not doing so well with controlling him while he's halfway up a wall. That's the problem. Okay, that's now twice I've tried to long jump in a row that has failed. So the whole batteries in the Wii Remote thing clearly didn't work. Although long jumping is Zed, which is on the nunchuck, so I don't know. I'm just blaming anything except me, because obviously I'm not the problem. I'm never a problem. Right, okay, I am very annoyed at what just happened, because I shook the remote! Maybe I just got a really bad remote, or maybe this game's controls just aren't that responsive. I don't know. Whatever it is, it's pretty annoying. Okay. Yes, the controls change direction, but seriously? I've picked up a coin. I'm sure I had enough health. I don't know. I am quite annoyed with the controls, that's all. The level... Not too bad. I'm enjoying the level. It's a challenge, but only... Okay, well, can you stop, please? Thank you. Okay, well, we're definitely going to run out of time now. And best what? I just pressed Zed and it did nothing again. I don't know. It's just annoying when the game doesn't do what you want it to do. And I'm sure I've said it too many times now, but it just... It needs to be said when it happens, just so you know I'm not sucking as hard as you think I am. Okay, here we go. That was actually pretty good. Okay, that was even better. Okay, now how do I do this? I don't know, but I need to know. There we go. I need to wall jump off the side one. Okay, now water, because this level needs to be more annoying. Oh, fire bar, you're going too slowly. Okay, at least there's a clock here. Come on. That's it. Right, we've got 21 seconds. I feel like we're quite near the end. I actually don't know. Oh, God. Oh, I forgot they kill you instantly. Oh, I also forgot he was even going to be there, to be honest. At least there are no checkpoints to worry about game overs. That's the one benefit of this level. The other benefit is it's pretty fun to play when the controls are actually paying attention to what I'm pressing. Right, here we go. Okay, don't fall in any lava this time, please. Doing pretty well. And you can die. There's always a weird delay with that one. I don't understand why. It's like you spin him and then half a second or so later, then he actually dies. I don't know. Maybe I'm imagining it. I can hear the star. That's just disappointing. Okay. The worst part is when you get hit by a fireball and then land in more lava. Like, that was about to... Oh my god, I'm gonna die. No, never mind. There's a coin here. Here we go. Time is mine. I'm not going to go for the extra life because it's not really gaining me anything. Okay, that was too close to that cheap cheap. Okay, I'm not sure how we're doing for time. I feel like we're about equal to where we were in the last run. Which is okay, I guess. But we don't know if we were anywhere close to done. Right, remember Mr. Thwomp is down here. That's it. Flop down. And if you could, like, let me off you, that would be nice. Okay, he's got a friend. His friend has an extra life for me, though. That's nice. 
We don't have to worry about his friend, apparently. Okay, here we go. Back to regular gravity, which is nice. And I can hear the star again, which means we must be close, right? Seriously, Goomba? Oh, it's the fact that they jump and they're about to hit you. That's what did it. Okay, super lucky with the coins there. No, get on that one. That's the whole point. Okay, if I die now, I'm going to be so annoyed. I'm already quite annoyed. Oh, God, I'm going to die from time, aren't I? No, I'm not. Come on. Let's do it without getting hit. There's one piece of... There's one piece left. Oh, 10 seconds remaining. One piece of health remaining. And there was a fire bar right up my butt. That was the flukiest fluke that ever did fluke. Oh dear, 84 stars. And another complete galaxy, which I'm happy about. Because it means we're getting closer to the end of the game. Because although this game is fun, we're up to episode 27 now. And I have my limits. Okay, what have we got? What's left in Starshine Beach Galaxy? I don't know, because I just pressed the wrong button. It's not complete, so we may as well go check it out. Right, there's a Comet Medal here somewhere as well. But we're here for the star, not the Comet Medal. We're going to have to come back for the Comet Medal. But for now, it's all about the stars. Climbing the Cloudy Tower. Oh, this doesn't look too bad. Just using the cloud power up a bit. Unless there's a time limit. There better not be. Okay, where is the cloudy tower? Oh, I see it. Okay, what? Oh, I was hoping I could uh, skip the water, but it's got its own gravity, so you can't. Whee! Thank you for the star bits. I don't think we're going to need star bits anymore. I don't think there are any more lumas, but I could be wrong. Heave ho! What are we heaving and why are we hoeing? Also, where is my cloud power up? Wait, are you a blue crab? I don't know. Because, oh. I'm just, it's just because blue crabs give extra lives, that's all. But I don't think we really need them. Right, what are we doing? Where do I get the cloud power up from? Because I can't stand on those clouds. Also, what's this guy doing? He's just sitting there doing nothing. Okay. If that's what he wants to do, I'm. who am I to judge? Right, no, but really, where is the cloud power up? Okay, maybe this level is not quite as simple as I thought. Uh, let me just have a have a look. I can't see it anywhere. Well, there's one up there, but that's not really helpful. Wait. I'm not supposed to ride one of those. Is that why the only this bubble machine is working? Because you have to get hit by it. Let's find out. Well, let's not find out, apparently. There we go. Where are we going to land? Oh. I thought it was going to be useful and actually take me somewhere good. But apparently not. Right. There must be something somewhere that I can use. Unless I can jump on those clouds, but I don't think so. Right, let's go and see what's up here, just for fun. Crabs! Oh, we have to stomp... No, you have to hit their butts. Well, no extra lives for me, I guess. Yeah, well, this has just been a nice little distraction from the problems of my life. Most of the problems are, where in the world is the cloud power up? Hmm. I got stuck in the sand because reasons. Okay, let's just try climbing up the cloud. But inevitably, it will fall down. Especially if you don't land on it. 
Wait, no, it's not going to fall down if you don't land on it. I know what I'm saying. Yeah, you can't do that. I'm sorry, but that, that is not what you have to do. Unless it is. No, I don't think there's, that's what they're going to make you do. No, the next one's not close enough. You have to have your own clouds to make it up the rest. So, where is it? Also, this whole level is covered in water. How are you supposed to make it back here with the cloud power up anyway? I don't even know. What's down this pipe? Something interesting, I hope. Get in! For God's sake. Oh, one of these. Why not? Extra lives, coins, all that nonsense. Round we go. And round... Well, you don't go round a square, do you? Although, you do kind of go round a square. Oh, I meant to do a backflip, but I did a long jump because controls. But seriously, where is this cloud power up? There must be one here, right? That's how you do the level. Okay, well... I cannot see anything of any use. Get out of the water, you idiot. Do these guys have anything useful to say? So no, they're just making various noises. What if I climb a tree? I can't climb a tree. There must be a power up here somewhere. Right? I'm not crazy. You can't do anything with this. And even if you could land on this cloud for more than a second, there's nowhere to go if you get to the second layer. Look. The third layer is too high up. So there must be a cloud power up somewhere. All these guys are just making stupid noises. What am I missing? Well, the cloud power up. But, like, how do I actually get it? I am so confused and also really annoyed at this stupid water. Maybe it's up in that shack. I guess it could be. I don't know. Oh, there's some garlic. Let's do this! Ah! No! That's not what I wanted! Oh wait, do they all throw me? No. I opened up my own leaf raft shop. Today is the grand opening, so feel free to ride all you want. Thanks. How does this work? It goes in the direction you point. Well, that's helpful, but I don't really know where you want me to go. Hmm. I'm very confused. There must be a cloud power up in this level somewhere. That is just how this level works. Surely. Unless I'm supposed to get one of these guys to throw me up there. That doesn't sound right. Okay, let's try that again. That's just going to be star bits, isn't it? Yep. That was pointless. What about you? Where are you going to throw me? The same place. Helpful, thanks. So, in that case... Maybe... That guy over there will throw me somewhere useful. I have no idea. Are you going to help, or are you just going to be annoying? Wait, is that what you have to do? I can't believe 
if I really spent all this time attempting to find a cloud power up and actually you can what do you want you see something sparkling way up there in the clouds oh yo, that was helpful thanks so maybe it is something to do with this guy I don't know can you aim him no he just throws you where he wants to throw you okay well that's not helping as fun as it is to get thrown up by this guy, all it's doing is throwing me up and getting me stuck in the sand. I actually do not know how to complete this level. There's more throwing guys over here. He's just going to throw me up to this tree, which is going to have... Star bits. Yeah. What about you? Have you got anything useful? He just got angry. Helpful. This is where we started. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to have to come back to this one, I think. Let's go back to the map and find something I actually know how to do. I may have to look the answer up for that level. As shameful as that is. I just... I don't want to spend three hours of my life wandering around a level hoping to find a power-up that may or may not even exist. I don't know. Let's go see our old friend Chompy. Oh wait, Chompy's dead. Sorry. Okay, so it's the same level as before, but with a spring power-up. Okay, I think I can deal with that. Although, this level was a bit annoying. If I remember correctly. Also, can't remember. Oh yeah. Is this the only level that has the spring power-up? Okay, what is it that I'm supposed to be doing? Oh, do I not have to... Oh, I don't think I have to do the actual level thing. Because the launch star is already here. Oh, I see. So it's just about making traversing slightly harder because you're using the spring. And of course you have to use the spring because otherwise it would be too easy, wouldn't it? Okay. Bounce. Thank you. Okay. This is really difficult to control. For some reason, he doesn't go in a straight line. There we go. Can I... No, you can't spin jump when you're a spring. Okay. I don't need to pick up another power-up. I've already got one. Oh, I remember this. Remember when we did this level the first time and I got really confused because I couldn't work out what it was I was actually supposed to be doing. And I spent ages getting up there because I thought it was going to be a secret. Yeah, it turns out I was just doing the wrong level. Well, it was the right level, but at the wrong time. Oh well. At least we found out eventually. Okay. And up we go. And up we go. And missed. And up we go. Come on, Mario. That's it. Right. And up again. And I can hear the star. This has been an... Oh no, 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 no. Oh, well, I guess we're starting that bit again. I was about to say this has been a really quick level, but I fell down. I can't work out why sometimes he goes the direction you're facing and sometimes he doesn't. Or does he always go the direction you're facing? I don't know. No, that time he was facing backwards when he did it. Okay, can we not fall off this time, please? Boing! Okay, here we go. Here we go. Come on. Oh, off a round thing. That's just mean. There we go. That was a pretty quick level. What a nice way to end an episode. What's that? Star number 84, I want to say? I don't know. Oh! We've brought another power up to the power up room. Oh, 85! We made more progress in this episode than I remembered. 
Isn't that good? Now what's this guy gonna say? Wait, wait, wait. This is a, a spring, huh? So you wear that. Does it make a big boing sound when you poke it? Haha. -ha. I'm so glad he contributes. He makes such a big difference to this game, you know? Because everything he says is so important and so useful. Anyway, come back next time where we're still on the way to the end by collecting more stars because that's the point of the game. See you then. Bye.